Surfing for me is illness. <laughs> Surfing is, is my best friend yet worst enemy. Genau erinnern, also als, als ich mein Abitur, also weil ich die ganzen Klausuren hatte, war ich den ganzen Tag am, also zu Hause am Studieren und ich wollte nur eine Stunde ins Wasser kommen, also da würde ich alles sauber machen, was ich meine ganzen Probleme, von meinen Problemen entferne. Vor allem hier auf, auf der Zone hier, die Reserra, haben wir richtig gute äh, Brief Breaks und Point Breaks und wir haben halt Weltklasse Wellen. I enjoy the visits. They're very refreshing. Is it? Now it keeps me awake. For sure. Keeps you on your toes, right? You know me toes, Mike. Yeah, it's been it's been great. I've been working with a lot of great people. My shaper Nick, we've been working together for the last 10 years, um, and his boards are the best in the world when it comes down to heavy waves. Um, I've tried a lot of boards around the world, and, and Nick has really been providing me with the right material at the right times. We come in front of ours. We're a board. Wants a board like Nico's. This is like a modern. This is like. This is a really modern blank that has a nice curve and nice distribution. Yeah. They used to be like these big chunky things. I had a national blank when we first started. That was like um, a camel in the middle. It came down from the nose. It started at like three and a half, four inches thick. Came down from the nose with a really bad curve. Hit the deck and the deck went up to like was it nine and a half, ten inches thick. And then it dropped again and went to the tail. Had like a camel back. So you started this thing planing sideways. But it's still, I mean, after a magic board, and I, I found anywhere in the world, from any shape or best machine in the world, there's something about a magic board. I think most of these guys, like Nikola, anybody, when they find a really magic board, you can make five of them just the same, but for some reason, not exactly the same. Yeah. You know, off the same cut, off the same machine, with the same foam and the same guy glassing and the same guy shaping in that, there's always a little tiny, some little tiny thing that makes a difference in, a, in that magic board. Was natürlich cool ist, wir sind halt zusammen aufgewachsen ähm, und äh, ja, es läuft eine ganze Zeit zusammen, was, was, was geil ist. Und wichtig, wenn du, ja, wenn, du, wenn du eine gute Gruppe hast, die, die gut surfen, helf, hilft natürlich beim Niveau von, von jedem. Chase tides. That's that's what I do. I'm not a professional surfer. I chase tides. That's that's what I do. It's uh, you're a slave of tides. You really want to know what time you know the right bank works with certain tides. So you're basically on a good good day of waves. You're just running around um, chasing tides. You know you go to Koshas on low tide. You go to Pedabrank on high tide, and you know you just go straight. You don't take your wetsuit out. And it's important to know when the tides are. You know. Having that on your watch is, is the ideal.